Hey, I'm Jeremy and I built Wonder Panel Pro because I got tired of clicking through the same menus over and over. So I made something faster. Let me show you how it works. To launch, go to Window, scroll down and select Wonder Panel Pro or Wonder Panel Basic. The panel lives anywhere in your workspace, docked or floating. For now, I'll keep it docked here. The panel has three zones, main buttons for creating layers, aligning objects, and rendering. An eight swatch color palette with Adobe Color slash ASE support, and then your utilities. Every button has multiple functions using modifier keys, Alt, Shift, and Control. Hold the key, click the button. Here's a quick example. Normal click creates a solid with my active color. Alt click opens settings for my selected solid. Let's try new shape. Click creates a rectangle. Shift creates an ellipse. Control creates a polygon and Alt opens the advanced shape dialog for even more control. All of the buttons work similarly. Hover over any of them to see the available shortcuts. Okay, now for my favorites. First is colors. Say I want to adjust this solid. Select it, click any swatch. Done. Works for text and shape layers too. Let's build a palette from scratch. I'm working on a project and need to import brand colors. Shift click any swatch, paste the hex code or multiple codes, the palette updates instantly. Or if you prefer to choose your own colors, just alt click to access the color picker. You can also grab palettes directly from color.adobe.com. Find something you like, copy the CSS format, paste, done. Works with LSS, SAS, XML, pretty much any format here. Ready to save your own palette? Click the sparkle icon, name it, save it for later. Want to share it with a teammate? Alt to click the sparkle to export as an ASE file. Shift, click to import. To cycle through your saved palettes, click the arrow. Need to paste colors into a document? Shift copies all the hex codes to your clipboard. Now for rendering. One click renders my active comp using whatever output module I've set as default. Alt adds it to the render queue. Shift is my favorite, instantly renders the comp and imports the file to my project. No more digging through folders for pre-renders. Now let's hit the gear icon for settings. This is where you customize everything, color palettes, default layer names, and more. The advanced tab is where you set render paths and output modules. Click scan to populate your After Effects output module templates. Pro tip, I keep different profiles for different types of work. For social media, vertical comps with web optimized exports. For VFX, my preferred alpha channel or pre-rendering output setup. Every client gets their own. Export your profile to sync across machines or swap between them per project. Want to change the UI without opening settings? Shift Alt on the first button cycles through layouts. Shift Alt on the second button changes the panel scale and the purge button. Click to clear memory and disk cache, add shift, and it also cleans up orphan solids in your project. And that's Wonder Panel Pro, designed to minimize clicks and keep you in your flow. Got feedback? We'd love to hear it. Visit wonderpanelpro.com to try the basic version free or grab the pro version on aescripts.com. Thanks for watching.